We have heart failure, we have heart disease, we have strokes, we have end-stage renal disease, we have peripheral vascular disease, which account for well over half of all the deaths and morbidity that we have in, in, the, in the low country. The good news, though, is that we can control blood pressure. We can lower blood pressure, both with lifestyle as well as with treatment in pharmaceuticals. So in our um, churches, we often talk about spiritual wellness, but what about physical wellness? So knowing your numbers, knowing um, what are the numbers to be concerned about? What are the numbers that are healthy? So with our check change control program that is being implemented in the congregations, we do believe that prevention starts with awareness. We have a lot of patients who come into the office um, once every three months or every six months. And if their blood pressure is a little high, you know, to have them come back in a week or two weeks later, they have so many barriers, whether it's transportation or financially, taking off work, um, it, it's difficult. So if they can monitor their blood pressure at home and, um, you know, call us with those results or if there's a way for us to monitor those, um, it would eliminate so many barriers and we'd be able to track patients' blood pressure so much more accurately.